Well, we'll see some rain overnight and then boom, Kate has a very nice looking seven day forecast with some mid 80s to talk about, but I don't want to steal all of your thunder just yet. All right, we got to wait till the seven day forecast. That was a spoiler. We're, we're waiting. But that's okay. Let's talk about the rain first and foremost. It hasn't really started coming down, at least not at a decent clip in Philadelphia just yet as we look live at Center City. Looking at the roads, nothing looking too wet, but there are some sprinkles coming down at least right now. Current conditions reported at the airport 56 degrees and cloudy so the rain is moving in quickly from south to north and the heaviest as we talked about at the top of the broadcast will be overnight winds have become easterly as that system starts to move off the coast and turns in a wind off the ocean water so it's going to be kind of cool and damp all night long today though we got to 68 degrees for the daytime high a very seasonable day we had sunshine at least for the first half of the day then those clouds started to roll in temperatures dropped a little bit clouds were heralding the the arrival of this mess, a storm moving through tonight. Heavy downpours right now back toward Hagerstown, Maryland, into portions of central Pennsylvania, and pretty much as close as maybe the state capital right now, but not much falling yet in the city. It has started to pick up across South Jersey and Delaware, and this will continue to overspread the region all night long. It's a relatively large storm system with the center of the low passing by just off to the south overnight tonight. So your storm timeline between now and 1 a.m., the the rain continues to overspread the area from southwest to northeast. The heaviest rain is between 2 a.m. and 6 a.m. Pockets of heavy downpours. The heaviest south and east of Philadelphia closest to the coast as that low passes offshore. But here's the good news. After 10 o'clock tomorrow morning, the showers taper. The sun emerges in time for lunchtime tomorrow and the afternoon actually looks really, really nice. And hey, you don't have to water the plants. 50 degrees outside tonight with periods of heavy rain winds southwesterly becoming northeasterly. We've already started to feel a little bit of that wind switch. And again, here's some of the heaviest rain around 3 a.m. Downpours across South Jersey and Delaware. That's going to continue about 4 or 5 a.m. And notice it is still raining north and west, but the heaviest is off to the south and east. Then by about 8, 9 o'clock tomorrow morning, we start to see the back edge of this precipitation roll through. The afternoon will feature clouds and breaks of sun with just the chance for a stray sprinkle here or there as we get into the evening hours. So as far as as rainfall amounts are concerned, a general half an inch. You can see lesser amounts to the north and some locally higher amounts to the south of over an inch of rain. Tomorrow, once the rain moves out, the sun breaks through. 67 degrees will be the daytime high. That is seasonable. But then as we get into next week, starting especially Tuesday, the jet stream lifting well to the north and it is going to be very, very warm. Look at your seven day forecast. After a little bit of a cool day Monday, Tuesday is gorgeous. Wednesday, we're at 80. 84 degrees, Thursday 82 with the shower, and then it does get a little cooler into next weekend, Joe. But next week's going to feel like a taste of summer. Very nice. I love it. Kate, thank you so much.